welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am going to go over the top 10 worst neighborhoods of Philadelphia. Stay tuned. Well, if you have watched my previous video, um, I've done a video called um, the areas that need the most opportunity. I don't necessarily like to say that these are the worst areas in Philadelphia uh, because Philadelphia is very block by block. You know, you can be in a, in a statistically a bad area, but if you have, you know, there's every bad area has some good pockets where it's not that much crime going on and not that much going on in the, in the area. Now, I need to mention that the reason why these are considered the worst neighborhoods, and this is strictly by violent crime. It's not that I'm saying that these, oh, these areas are bad, you know, however, no. This is just statistics and you can find this data at data.philly.com slash philly slash crime. And you can sort this by violent crime. So this particular site that I have gotten this information from varies month to month. It refreshes every 30 days. So when you're researching for places to live, just keep in mind that crime does happen everywhere. There's no such thing as a 100% safe neighborhood. All we can do is go by the statistics. So with that being said, I'm going to go down my list of the top 10 list of worst neighborhoods in Philadelphia. And before I get into it, if you can please like the button, uh, smash that like button so that it helps me out. It really helps the channel and it helps me um, so that I can be able to bring great content to you. And with that, I will go down my list. Thanks again. Number 10, we are starting at concessing. Concessing is north of Southwest Philadelphia. It is a part of Southwest though. Um, the median income is 26,170 and the crime rate is 1.13. Number nine, we are at Mantua. Mantua is east of Parkside and the median income is 17,172 and the crime rate is 1.20%. North Philadelphia slash east, this is east of Broad. We have in this area, the median income is 19,719 and the crime rate is 1.28. Southwest Philadelphia, which is number seven, is located, it's part of concessing, it's Southwest Philadelphia. So when you move further, uh, west, um, you're in Delaware County um, from Southwest, and the median income is 26,835, and the crime rate is 1.37. Number six on our list is West Philadelphia slash Parkside. It is west of Parkland, and it, the median income is 22,396, and the crime rate is 1.43. Number five on our list is North Philadelphia slash what on the west side. The median income is 19,666 and the crime rate is 1.46. Number four is Tioga Nice Town. Um, that is west of Huntington Park. Well, it's technically Hunting Park, uh, but west of Hun Hunting Park. And the median income is 24,760 and the crime rate is 1.46. Number three on our list is Kensington. Kensington has a median income of 25,997 and it's west of Port Richmond. Um, the crime rate is 1.63. Number two is Huntington Park. Hunting, Huntington Park slash Hunting Park. The median income is 20, uh, 20,019. The crime rate is 1.65. And here we are with some honorable mentions. Some honorable mentions are Fairhill, which is 1.11 in crime rate, East Germantown, which is 1.04, and Logan, which is 0 0.99. And number one on our list is Parkland. Parkland, what's kind of special about Parkland is, is that Parkland doesn't have a lot of homes in it. It actually has the smallest population at approximately 1,278 people living in this neighborhood. 
And um, Parkland kind of consists, consists of along um, Vermont Road in West Philly. Um, the crime rate is 4.69. That number is extremely high. Remember that this was updated like within the last 30 days. So I believe that this may have happened during the Christmas holiday. But regardless, that is it with my list. To add more to this is that when I researched this for this video, I noticed that this the reason why this area has a lot of violent crime, mainly these areas have really high poverty, high unemployment rates, and it's higher rent, rent to owner ratio. So, but again, like I said, this these neighborhoods that I may set that I have said today they have some good areas and some bad areas remember Philly is block by block so if you have one part if everything is statistically bad you may have find a pocket that doesn't have that much crime in it so uh, with that being said I thank you for watching this video now tell me in the comments below which one of these neighborhoods shocked you the most what could in what neighborhoods do you think that you may be thinking about purchasing in but you're thinking about it and you just want to know a little bit more about these particular areas now again let's start the conversation below let me know which areas you were most interested in and what you were su surprised at and as well as if you could please hit that like button if you have not done that already please hit that like button so that it helps the algorithm please subscribe to the channel so that you are aware as to when i do uh posts and also that click click that notification bell but anyway regardless thank you so much and i will see you on the next one